Take it easy. Take it easy. This is Unit 12, just responded to 80th and CPW. Picked up a female, 25 to 27 years old. She collapsed while pushing her child on a swing. Oh, it's normal. Blood pressure, 120 over 80. IV is hooked up. No bodily bruises. Yeah, no, no, no. To the head. <laughs> Breathing erratically. Gasping. Very hard to handle. Just take it easy. Take it easy, okay? Don't move. We're rushing her in just as fast as we can. Can't make out anything she's saying. What? What's the matter? What? What's your name? It's all right. It's all right. Don't don't move. Don't move. Look, take it easy. We're coming to the hospital now. We're almost to the hospital now. Hi, Doc. Hi, Roy. Dextro seems to be working, but I did have some trouble with it. Yeah, here. What's the problem? Oh, don't worry. You're going to be all right. I'm done. I'm done. What? Do you hear what I'm saying? Can you understand what I'm saying? The nurse is going to check on your baby. Your baby. Okay? She's getting some flashcards for you to look at, and the sign language interpreter is coming. You just rest. Okay? Okay. You are deaf, right? She's okay. She's at the police station until someone can pick her up. She's okay. Okay. Flash your the disease card. Any diseases or illnesses? No, no. No, no. Quick, heart disease. No, no. Heart no, disease. No, no, no. No, no. No, no. Diabetes. No, Try no. diabetes. Okay. No, no. Diabetes. No, no. Do you take insulin? Mm. Mm. 
insulin. Mm. See, she's eaten recently. Have you eaten in the last six hours? Mm. No. Ask if she's allergic to any drugs. Are you allergic to anything? No. no. Okay. Hello, doctor. Uh, I'm the sign language interpreter you called for. Would you excuse me, nurse? I'm going to stand next to the doctor. If you would just speak directly to the patient so that she can see both of us at the same time, I'll interpret everything that we're saying. Okay. okay. She seems to have been in diabetic shock. Mm. Yes. Your, what's your name? Janice Cole. Cole, is that C-O-L-E? C-O-L-E, easy name. Okay. Janice, you are a diabetic. Yes. When did you take your medication last? This morning, this morning. What dosage do you take? I take 25 units of Lenti every morning and 15 units of Lenti last night. 25 in the morning, 15 last 25 night. 25 units of Lenti in the morning and 15 in the evening. Yes, right. So when did you eat last? And what did you eat? Uh, last night I went to a party and they had different kinds of food and uh, I drank a little bit, alcohol. Alcohol. That's a mistake. You've been under pressure recently? Working too hard? Oh, yes, yes. I've been working on my thesis for six months. Recently, I finished, and I went to a party. So I was just playing around, having a good time. Mm -hmm. Have you been physically active in the past few hours? Yes. I finished the party, and I, I went to pick up my husband, Mark, take him to the airport. When he finished that, I went home to pick up my daughter, and I took her to the park to play, play, and play, and then boom, I collapsed. Mm -hmm. Who's your doctor? Dr. Irwin White. Irwin White. Where's his office? His office is 5th Avenue and 10th Street. 5th Avenue and 10th? Right. Nurse, keep the IV in, draw bloods on her, and get her a sandwich. Yes, doctor. You're fine. I'll check back with you soon. It's okay. Thank you. My pleasure, doctor. Is there anyone we can contact for you? Yes, contact my husband, Mark. Oh, no, wait a minute. Mark is out of town. Uh, contact my sister, Mary. Uh, I'll give you her phone number. Uh, could you, could you yes. take that down for me? My sister is deaf. Uh, her phone number is 260-8330. And please tell my sister to pick up my daughter, take her to my mother's home, and when she's finished, come here to see me, please. Okay, I'll make that phone call for you. Right. Thank you very much. Okay, see you shortly. Don't worry, you're going to be fine. Just relax. Services, may I help you? Yes, uh, my name is Carl Chapinski. I'm a sign language interpreter at Mount Sinai Hospital, and uh, I'm calling for a patient by the name of Janice Cole. We'd like to contact her sister Mary, and the TTY number is 260-8330. Hold it, let me copy that down. That's TTY 260-8330? Right. Okay, I'll call her. Just a moment. It's ringing.
It's Mary. Hold on. to know what's the matter. Okay. Mary, your sister Janice was brought into uh, Mount Sinai in diabetic shock. She seems to be okay now, but she would like you to come to the hospital to see her. But before that, would you please tell her to pick up her daughter Melinda at the 10th Street Police Station, drop her off at Mother's house, and then come to the hospital. Okay, I'll let her know. Are you her sister? Oh, yes, I am. You are deaf, too? Yes, I am. I'm glad that you came. We had a, a difficult time until we figured out that she was deaf. We used flashcards. Flashcards? Flashcards. Everything's fine now. You can relax. Your sister was in diabetic shock, but she's okay now. We, we have to take some more tests, so I'm going to have to ask you to leave for a little while. Janice Cole? Pardon? Are you with the deaf girl? Yes, we are. I'm her sister, Mary, and this is my husband, Shirley. How do you do? You speak very well. Thank you. I wear a hearing aid, and that helps a little. And also, I'm a good lip reader. Are you both deaf? Yes, she speaks well. I don't feel comfortable speaking. Some deaf people are skilled at speaking, some aren't so skilled. I have a little bit of hearing. Hearing aid doesn't help me, and my lip reading isn't that good. I was one of the guys who brought her in. I didn't know she was deaf. I had a hard time talking to her. I want you to know how grateful we are that everything is all right. Oh, that's okay. I had a hard time understanding her. I, I thought she was gasping. I'm sorry. I didn't know she was deaf. Interesting, they used these flashcards in the emergency room, and if they didn't, it could have been a real emergency. Yeah. Oh, I'm using those cards in the ambulance from now on. That's good. You could easily learn some signs, too. Oh, that's good. I'd like that. 
First, when you talk to a deaf person, always speak normally. Don't over enunciate or slow your words. Second, always face the deaf person. Don't let your head move around or change your visual focus. Third, expression is very important. Deaf people need that to understand you. And finally, keep your hands in an area from here to here. Don't throw them out in space, okay? Okay, good. And sign language is like any other language. It has its own set of rules and expressions. Are you deaf? Are you deaf? Are you? Are you? Deaf? Deaf. Are you? Are you? Deaf? Deaf. Yes. 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 No. 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 It's all right. It's it's all right. It's, it's all, all right. right. It's all right. Okay. Don't worry. Don't worry. Don't don't worry. Don't worry. Thank you. Thank you. Thank, Thank you. you. Good. 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 Okay. Uh, how would you say, uh, uh, what happened? What? What? Happened. Happened. What? What? Happened. Happened. What? What? Happened. Happened. Good. Good. How would you say, uh, um, where, where does it hurt? Where? Where? Hurt. Hurt. Oh. When you ask a question, it's important to keep a question and look on your face. Okay. Where hurt. does it hurt? Where hurt? Good. Okay. Uh, how would you say, have you taken any uh, drugs or medication? Medication. Swallow. Swallow. You. you. Medication. Swallow. You. Okay, what's that? Medication. Swallow. You. Okay. Where does uh, the sign medication come from? The sign medication comes from the scientific sign for mortar and pestle. Oh, I see. How would you say, are you allergic to anything? Medication. Medication. Swallow. Swallow. Itch. Itch. Sneeze. Sneeze. You. You. Okay, again. Medication. Swallow. Swallow. Itch. Sneeze. Sneeze. You. Okay, let's see now. Medication. Swallow. Itch. Sneeze. You. Oh, that's good. Uh, how would you say, did you eat recently? Recently. Recently. Eat. Eat. You. You. Oh, that's an easy one. Recently. Eat. Eat. You. You. Recently. Eat. Eat. You. You. Oh, that's great. Could I, could we do it again? You. Are you deaf? Deaf. Yes. Yes. No. No. Don't worry. Don't worry. It's all right. It's all right. Thank you. Thank you. Good. Good. What happened? What happened? Well, yeah. does it hurt? Does it hurt? Medication. Medication. Swallow. Swallow. You. You. Medication. Medication. Swallow. Swallow. Itch. Itch. Sneeze. Sneeze. You. You. Recently. Recently. Eat. Eat. You. You. Good. Good. Let's try it one more time. Okay. You. Deaf. Deaf. Telephone. Have to work.
Thank you. Janice, this happened because you didn't eat, causing your sugar level to drop too low. Everything is okay, but remember, no hard work and no parties. You get some sleep and eat regularly, okay? Okay. Thanks for your help. My pleasure, Doctor. Good day. Okay, Janice, it was nice to meet you. Can you take care of yourself, okay? Yes, that was me on the TTY. Uh, thank you so much for calling me. I really appreciate that. Are you uh, married? Yes, I am. Oh, hi. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. My husband, Charlie. Hi, Charlie. Oh, it's my pleasure. It's okay. Uh, I have to go, but uh, Janice, take care of yourself. I'll see ya. All right. It'll be all right. Hey, Ted, bring a stretcher. 